Here is how to easily sew Rigoline plastic boning into the seams of your GS Blooming Bustier dress, or any garment really. Here is my main and lining fabric. This mock seam is the side front seam where the seam allowance is pressed towards the center front. The Rigoline will be sewn onto the top of this seam allowance. I've marked the neckline seam allowance along the top edge so I know where to place the boning. Because my main fabric is quite bulky, I'm placing it so that the top edge is just a smidge below that seam line I've drawn. Once it's sewn in place and you've attached the main and lining together along the neckline, you should be able to understitch it easily with the boning staying on the inside. After a good press, from the right side, you shouldn't see the seam or boning poking up over the edge. If you do, you placed the bone too close to that upper edge. Or if you placed it too low, the seam can collapse and expose the top of the boning too. It's a good idea to practice sewing this placement on some fabric scraps to find the ideal placement for your fabric. 